Today was a special one for the owners of the East Springfield restaurant, any Springfield restaurant, that's gone through major renovations. City leaders taking a tour of the Boulevard Tavern and Grill, which received federal pandemic funding to help with that effort and continue preserving the neighborhood's history in the building. Western Mass News reporter Matt Price was at the tour, and he gives us an inside look. The continuation of the start of a new chapter for a very well-known and historic restaurant in East Springfield. The Boulevard Tavern and Grill, which has had other names in the past, is now a spot where everyone can be together, enjoy some food, and embrace old memories. It's a lot of memorabilia from previous previous owners and, and, and patrons and families. Everybody comes in and points to something and says, that's my uncle, that's my father. Uh, you know what I mean? It's, it, there, there's... There's a lot of ties to the neighborhood here. On Monday, Springfield Mayor Dominic Sarno, Chief Development Officer Tim Sheehan, and other local leaders joined the Sullivan family to recognize the more than 100-year-old building. ARPA funds went to move this establishment forward, again, creating jobs, keeping jobs, also supply lines with vendors and materials, so we're very, very uh, happy about this. Sullivan tells Western Mass News that before he and his son started owning the restaurant, the boulevard was among many businesses that faced the impact of COVID-19. As a result, it received $75,000 from the Sarno administration through the American Rescue Plan Act's Small Business Program. And the owners used that money to help renovate the eatery for the last three to four months, which cost around $300,000. It opened the door. It, it made it worth it. It was, it was definitely a contribution that, that made anything, you know, a beginning possible. Thanks to the ARPA funding and the new renovations, the Boulevard now is able to continue preserving all kinds of memorabilia, including this confessional box that was in the old Our Lady of Hope Church, a way for patrons to remind themselves about the history of East Springfield. We wanted to preserve the history of this place as well as we could. So we, we want to make extra effort and let everyone see that extra effort that we're making. The Boulevard is now offering a full Irish American menu. Sullivan only asked the public to do one thing, come on in. I want them to see that it's clean and new and it, it, it's presentable. I want people to know that they can come in here, feel safe and, and have a good meal and, and a casual good time. Sullivan says there will be a new look coming for the outside. That said, the neighborhood's history and the boulevard's hospitality live on. In East Springfield, Matt Price, Western Mass News.